I was a flight surgeon with the Air Force for several years, and one of the things I really enjoyed about that is the chance to deal with healthy people. And it taught me that if you focus on wellness, and you can actually optimize somebody's health. And so, so much, so many Western trained physicians like myself were taught to fix and cure, and we were take, taking people at some level of illness state and trying to get them fixed or cured to get them into a wellness state. And yet when I, I began to lose hope that that was working very well for the chronic illnesses, but then I began to realize once you focus on the underlying cause, that is healing, focus on healing, you can reduce and in some cases eliminate the needs for the fixes and cures. And so by targeting cholesterol, diabetes, weight, hypertension, metabolic disorders, by focusing on the underlying issue, then I think you do the people so much better in the long term. Um, on slide two, it talks about diabetes. Now, diabetes has been an interest and a passion for mine now for a little over a decade, closer to 15 years, actually. And, and here's some very interesting and sobering statistics. Uh, at the current time, a, a little over two-thirds of the people are OB, obese or overweight. There's 1.6 million new cases of DM, diabetes mellitus, this year. Unfortunately, if 300,000 of those will be pediatrics, it's probably going to be higher very much sooner. By 2020, half of the population is going to be either diabetic or pre-diabetic. Diabetes, even though there's two types, type 2 diabetes is actually number one because of these sobering numbers. Uh, it's the number one cause of acute MI or heart attack less than age 30. It's the number one cause of bl new cause of blindness. It's the number one cause of lower extremity amputations. It's the number one cause of renal disease which for adults can take place over 20 years, but unfortunately for the kids it can happen as fast as 24 months. The costs greatly exceed the revenues of the fast food system, and it's going to absolutely be more than 150% of our Medicare budget by 2025. And so you can imagine there's a tremendous sense of urgency to get after this problem because if you spend more just on diabetes than in the entire budget. It leaves no money for stroke, no money for high blood pressure, no money for cholesterol, no money for osteoporosis, nor all the other ailments that people are going to want and need taken care of. And so we have got to get this thing under control. For every 1% increase in hemoglobin A1C, the average blood sugar 60 days, costs the patient $1,000 a year. I'm an optimist, so I like to look at that in reverse, and that is that for every 1% we decrease in A1C, we save the patient $24, sorry, $1,000 a year. On slide three, uh, this came out several years back. They found that for a child born in 2000, this next millennium, the lifetime risk of developing diabetes is a third for males, a little higher than that for females. And if they have Hispanic genetics, that goes up even higher to 45% for males, 53% for females. So this is the first time that the lines have crossed over and we have now entered an era where one-third of the kids will be buried by their parents, which is a tragedy due to the problems of diabetes. And so if we go to the next slide, we understand that we have now the dubious honor of being the United States of Diabetes, according to the United Health Report in December 2010, which shared with us the health care costs for non-diabetics are $4,400 a year, but when you get diabetes, it triples to almost $11,700 a year, and if you have complications, it goes up five times to over $20,000 a year. It's clearly a weight-related illness, and gaining as little as 11 pounds can double the risk, as little as 17 pounds can triple the risk of getting diabetes. So if we focus and target on that underlying cause of diabetes, that is that visceral abdominal fat, we can then begin making a difference in a lot of ways. So the next slide talks about the solution. Now I've been working with some form of this for the last 15 years, now practicing medicine 20 years. And uh, in its generation two is when I first discovered it, more science over time has developed and now we've grown this into a generation four product, BIOS Life Slim. And I believe it is the first scientific breakthrough in fat loss in over 30 years. Some would argue it is the biggest breakthrough in fat loss ever. And when we get a chance to watch a video clip to understand why, then you'll agree with me uh, by viewing that. It's composed of real science as we see on slide six. These are not, you know, these, these are leading research institutes and universities, not just in the U.S., but around the globe. 
Cleveland Clinic, Stanford School of Medicine, University of Utah, UCLA, those are all U.S.-based. The Cleveland Clinic, uh, the same guy that did the study on Lipitor, uh, studied Bios Life, Bios Life Complete, actually, Generation 3, and the results of his study were very impressive. It rivaled, if not exceeded, that what we found in the prescription drug market with the famous drug Lipitor, which is that 10,000-pound gorilla that uh, is available for people around the world, which goes generic later this year, believe it or not. Now, in the lower right-hand corner, you've got Numico Labs. They're a 100-year-old nutrition company. They were responsible to, for developing IV nutrition and pediatric nutrition and formulas way back. They have over 450 PhD scientists on staff. They are the largest think tank in the world. And again, our research affiliation and some of the products we have come out of Numico Labs. So we're not talking about any funky roots or herbs grown in somebody's basement. We're talking about solid scientific science that with reproducible results that quite frankly rivals many of the prescription drugs out there. Slide 7 talks about the scientific validation that I alluded to last slide, and it's a patented fat-burning formula, very effective at lowering LDL cholesterol upwards of 31%, and also in increasing, clinically proven to increase that good HDL cholesterol, that hard-to-raise cholesterol uh, of 29%, and there's no prescription drug out there that will do that. That can be found, again, in the physician's desk reference. If we summarize on slide eight, Bioslide Slim is a 90-day program. You want to use it for a minimum of 90 days, and it's clinically proven to be safe, and safety is so key these days. People don't like side effects. It's proven to be uh, healthy and effective at burning fat and losing inches. Now, make no mistake, there are no fat burners or stimulants in there in any way, shape, or form, but because we're keeping our insulin levels low, we're able to release that stored insulin, that stored fat rather, because the insulin levels are low, and by in turn, because of its composite nature, improve our cholesterol numbers. So the summary just very basically says increasing the good cholesterol, decreasing the bad, like we mentioned, balancing out or lowering blood sugars in diabetics, dropping triglycerides of upwards of 80%. The studies support 40, but clinically, I see 80 or more. I see some people, guys, down 100 or more points. It reduces their appetite and cravings regulates out their bowel function to include irritable bowel and all kinds of issues these days with that. Certainly the energy is very important because so many people that are hyperinsulinemic, they're running around with their bodies teeming with insulin, it's very fatiguing. So these individuals find themselves reaching out for energy drinks or stimulants and caffeine and all kinds of stuff. And uh, because of the energy that you experience with Biosite by keeping those insulin levels low, Oftentimes, that cultivates the desired exercise. I've never seen anything like this in medicine where people actually begin to want to go be active, which further accelerates the results people get with SLIM. And please understand, this is not a diet. You do not use this instead of eating or skip any meals. It's actually a way to lose inches more than pounds. People tend to step on the scales because that's the way we're conditioned. However, I exhort people to measure their inches because the clothes get baggy, the belt notches in, uh, the sizes go down faster than the scales drops. It's totally safe in pregnancy, nursing mothers, and totally safe in children. And uh, again, just not a diet, a wonderful solution, and it's helping so many people. If we look at slide nine, we see that it, it's time has come. 65% of adults are overweight. Unfortunately, within the next 20 years, we're going to have 9 out of 10 Americans are going to be overweight. That's incredibly bad. That means only 1 out of 10 Americans are going to be normal weight. So uh, we have got to get after this. Its timing is, is just key for a great solution to, to deal with that. And, and since diabetes is a weight-related illness, slide 10 talks about an example, a very typical reproducible example of an individual who's had diabetes carrying around the peripheral, sorry, the abdominal central obesity. And as a result, you know, at 205, a waist 40, three different blood pressure medications, average fast, blood fasting sugar is going up. And he's in a pre, if not a diabetic state. And yet in 90 days, as a result of SLIM, not only visually does he look better, but his numbers are all improving. So what I love about SLIM is that 
you know, we give people what they want, and that is the ability to look good because it sheds the unwanted pounds, and we're a visual society. But what we're really doing medically is we're giving them what they need, and that is something to improve and target and heal the body, the underlying issue, thereby taking care of other their chronic ailments and illnesses. And uh, so no wonder they're so happy. It, and it, this problem in slide 11 extends back to our kids. In fact, we, as those of us listening to this uh, information right now, I would tell you, we as a society are getting diabetes 20 years before our parents did. Unfortunately, in turn, our children are getting diabetes 20 years before we will. And it's an epidemic called globesity. And the kids start at a very early age. Unfortunately, they're getting foods very low in fiber, high fructose corn syrup, all kinds of issues that's creating abdominal fat. Now, when kids gain weight, they do so through a process known as hyperplasia, which means they multiply the number of fat cells in their body. As adults, when we gain weight, we already have a finite number of fat cells. We grow the size of the fat cells. So imagine a child multiplying his or her number of fat cells, carrying that to their adult life, and then they have a higher number of cells that in turn get even larger. That's how people achieve 500, 600, 700 pounds or more. It began in their childhood. The problem is, as the slide shows, that the, these fat kids are found to have arteries of 45-year-old men, and that dramatically accelerates the risk for heart disease. And I see these, the results of these kids that have grown up, now they're seeing me in the emergency department in their 30s and 40s with heart attacks. Uh, last week we had a 40-year-old weightlifter who had gained a bunch of weight, but he had lost some of the weight over the years, and he had a full-blown MI with a major blockage, uh, a total occlusion of his LAD artery. They had to rush him to the cath lab and save his life by opening up his artery. He was 40 years old. So... That's a disease normally not found until 60s or 70s, and so we see it in these kids. But SLIM is showing so much strong benefits in these kids. It's the only thing that I could write or recommend as a physician that has a safety profile for our kids. And so not only that, the kids like the taste. So not only is it good for them, they like it and it works. They get very dramatic results, so we love that. Slide 12 is a very typical example of that. Here's an individual whose brothers and sisters are uh, distance runners, and yet he, Scotty was too overweight to run or to compete in the uh, wrestling championships. Five months later, 34 inches down, 40 pounds down, and half. He was 36% body fat, so he lost a, uh, uh, 18% in uh, that time period, and he's just a different person, so now he's an all-state wrestler. So very safe in kids, and it works very well. So slim, and slide 13, as you can see, is basically a very remarkable formula. I mean, there's nothing more powerful than a product whose time has come. It's unparalleled market demand. It's very easy to explain. In fact, you don't have to, you know, even explain it to people. You could let them listen to this presentation, listen to the audios that are available, the top-notch videos that are available. And so it's easy to use. It's easy to explain because the technology does the work. When people hear the information, it's easy to buy because they want to purchase it. And so that makes it easy to sell because it, you're not doing the selling, it sells itself. It's consumable, so it endures very high reorder rates. In fact, the company's numbers show us that somebody who's been on Slim for 90 days, there's a 90% reorder rate. And you can imagine how emotional people get because of the measurable, measurable visual results they see. I've got some patients, guys, who are down 90 pounds, 20 pant sizes, in six months, and so that just turns heads, not to mention the dramatic health improvements they've experienced. So it's unique, exclusive, it's patented, provides long-term results, and uh, I, I think what we better ought to call this is a home run. Now, because Slim is so good and because it's so different, uh, it's, those roots go clear back to, as we see in slide 14, decades of credibility, originally founded with the old Rexall drugstores that we all grew up with, the one cent sale, the corner drugstore, and today that has morphed into a business that's in the top 500 privately held businesses in all of America. In slide 15, 
it's actually 87th, not just the top 500, and it's ranked number one in Utah. And the re what's really interesting is our company has surged to almost double in size in the last couple of years during an economic winter, primarily because it takes back to the product again. This formula works so well, and that's why we see such growth with a great company. So in slide 16, basically this is what the customer or the patients uh, like to know about. It's a 90 day program, what does it cost? Retail, 121.95, and at full retail, that's $4 a day. What a great investment for your health. It's far less money than any diet out there, and with this not being a diet, people more than save the $4 a day they spend on Slim, not just in the food and the grocery bill immediately, but even more than that, in the medications they begin uh, weaning down and eventually being able to stop, really improving their finances. They have discounts available. There's a preferred customer auto refill, which basically is 103-ish. They give you free shipping, and that's a program that comes to your house, to the patient's house, once a month, just like a magazine subscription. There is a customer premium value pack where basically people can buy at a below wholesale structure, which is four boxes, but they only pay for three. And typically what happens is you begin using it, and people notice it, and they ask you about it. So oftentimes you have a box to share with another individual. Um, and so many people are gravitating toward that value pack for that reason. So again, Slim being very different on slide 17, the company has been able to offer this through a very unique channel. And as a result of the way they offer it, it translates into a very significant income opportunity for those that decide to participate. Why is that? Well, it's an emotional product. You improve somebody's health, they can't stop talking about it. And because of that, it provokes very strong customer loyalty, and it cannot be found elsewhere. It's proprietary. So people have found that this franchise-type operation is allowing them to design their own involvement, part-time, full-time, sometimes, in and around their busy day jobs without interfering with it. And some people are earning a few to several hundred and a few to several thousand dollars or more on a monthly basis, depending on what they decide to do with it. Now, the company's expanded internationally, and on slide 18, we see how that uh, can, can be actually be built. You can use this to build a national or an international business. Uh, the largest markets currently are Europe and Asia, as you can see in the slide. However, there's a very large untapped market in South America, in Africa, and the hottest market right now that is in pre-marketing phase is India. So if you know anybody of Indian descent, I would definitely encourage you to, to talk to them because India has a very specific genetic challenge that leads them rapidly to diabetes. The population of India, just in the middle class alone, exceeds the U.S. population in its entirety. And there's 25 million diabetics, you may remember from the beginning of this talk, in the U.S. In India, there's over 300 million diabetics, all compressed into a small land area. and so. We expect BiosLife to be very popular over there, and it already is, and so there's a chance to uh, really make a big difference in the world by getting there as well as international markets that you know that have people of Indian descent because they all have relatives and roots that take them back there. So wonderful chance to build an international business. Slide 19, basically it's a franchise setup, very low startup costs, no overhead, no employees, very minimal inventory as we would be the opposite found in a traditional franchise. In here, there's multiple profit centers. And you can see from the slide, you can buy at wholesale, sell at retail. Those profits are anywhere from $30 to $50 per unit. And there's profit sharing bonuses that go up to 30% or more. If you know people that you want to share this with on slide 20, you could simply see, you could even just sharing it directly, you could build a retail base. And if you just knew 10 people on a monthly basis, that would generate an extra monthly income of $500 that would dramatically impact the majority of the households that do that, 90% of the bankruptcies in America last year could have been averted with an extra three to $400 a month coming in the household. And here, if you just know 10 people, you've got an extra monthly income of 500 that, that could be permanent. So not to mention the other very serious pipelines of income which can go far beyond that should you so decide and so some people are taking this as a full-time business. On slide 21, it talks about joining the product, or starting the product, if you will, and joining the mission. We have a very important mission out there that I would love all of you 
to help identify people with because they, they battle diabetes, they battle weight, and all the associated problems that go with it, heart disease. And so we have a chance to make an impact and a difference. And so for people from a business standpoint, uh, some of those will pick that uh, good associate pack, which is the four-box pack we talked about earlier, but some people want a little more than that. And so the company allows them to take more significant ownership when they start. As a result, they will increase their commissions. There's a better package, uh, which is basically nine boxes of slim or a combination, or a 19 boxes of slim called the best package, manager pack, where the commissions go up even further and uh, sets, in, uh, sets in motion the chance to earn even more significant bonuses down the road. On slide 22, we would learn that there are so many healthcare professionals that have uh, joined our business, and as a result of those healthcare professionals joining our business, they have uh, they've decided that they know patients. They have either have either 25 patients or 50 patients or 100 patients or more, and as a result of that, they want to share the formula with their, their patients. And so the company has created a structure where a person that says sees, say sees a hundred dollars a hundred uh, patients a month that has diabetes, there's a hundred box pack to start their clinic out. If they only see 50 patients a month, they, there's a 50 box pack. And if they only see 25 patients that have diabetes or weight problems in a month, there's a 25 box pack. And the profits are commensurate with those and they go up dramatically as a result of that. So with that, I would encourage you uh, to think about this, and that is if you were to see what we're doing here makes sense and you could be part of our leadership team, help us open up your market, the U.S. and then, of course, the rest of the countries in the world, would you like to team up with us? And if the answer is yes, we'd love for you to identify that to the person that showed this to you, and we'd be happy to help you uh, get started and join the team. Thank you very much.